Mackenzie. Michaela Schifrin, can she take it to another level? And she does because she's fast right out of the gate, and that's something she works at. Look at that. 15 seconds in, she's three tenths up. Watch her technique. The hands and the shins hit the gate at the same time, then she moves on to that new ski. Great energy, specifically at the bottom as well. Shield stability, but with different speed. And what kind of speed was it? Sometimes she can be a little bit cryptic, but the clock, oh, it never lies. Boom! One second. Let's see if she catches the rhythm early on. That's been one of the goals this year. What we saw in that first run was that stoic upper body, but really good explosion on the lower legs. <laughs> she is on it again. Oh, man. Has actually lost a little time, but that was fantastic skiing. All right, here are those oh four my. big turns through there. Four more before she can really relax. Look at that. On top of it, a little bit of a stumble right there. And this is Michaela Schifrin just very much in control, bleeding a little bit of time. All right, oh, again, up and over her ski just a little bit. She's losing time, but eight tenths to play with. It's really just staying out of any major difficulty. Easier said than done. And still has the energy, a lot of time on physical fitness, so she's strong here. Schifrin to the line, and you got a winner. Michaela Schifrin managing a lead beautifully. Mom finally can breathe a sigh of relief. You know, it wasn't the cleanest run. A couple times getting onto that inside ski a little early, getting over the handlebars, but both times, three times in fact, getting that recovery, and then at the bottom, gorgeous. Frida Hansdotter wondering what she can possibly do to go in front of her. Nevertheless, Hansdotter, Piete de Homer, faster runs make Schifrin in the second run, but still Schifrin on top, victory number seven in slalom.